Hello, this is Nick from Laptop Media, and today we will show you how to open the Dell Latitude 14 5450. To see the internals, you have to undo eight captive Phillips head screws. Use a lever tool to lift the zones behind the hinges. After that, fully pry the back, the sides, and the front. This device has the optional 54 watt hour battery. The base model is a 42 watt hour variant. To take it out, pull out the connector from the motherboard and undo the five Phillips head screws that secure the unit in place. The optional capacity is enough for around nine hours of video playback. To achieve that, you have to apply the best power efficiency preset in the Windows power and battery menu and select the optimized power plan in the Dell Optimizer app. According to Dell, the two SODIMs can handle up to 64 gigabytes of DDR5 RAM in dual channel mode. However, since the CPU can support up to 96 gigabytes, this laptop likely wouldn't have issues running a larger amount of memory than the official manufacturer's specified limit. The devices with core ultra processors boast 5600 megahertz modules, while the ones with 13th gen chips rely on 5200 megahertz sticks. The W1 slot that is for optional LTE or 5G connectivity can be seen next to the cooling. The Wi-Fi card is on the right of the SODIMs. For storage, you get a single M.2 slot compatible with the shortest 2230 Gen 4 SSDs. The NVMe drive is protected by a metal cap that is secured in place by two Phillips head screws. we found a small thermal pad on the inside of the metal plate. The cooling seems simple. It has one large fan, a single heat pipe, a pair of heat sinks, and a heat spreader. The cap above it covers the motherboard's VRMs.